Dorian Yates, 1997. Big Rammy, Momdell's Baye, 2022. This is the comparison we are looking at today. We're going to run through the eight mandatory shots, and I'll give you my opinion on who I think is better. Of course, this is part of your fan-requested Friday lineup. Oops, I, I forgot that's for you pick. Two, two, Tuesday. What have you, what have you. But yes, you guys voted for this one, and it came in second place, if I'm not mistaken. Dory Nates, a lot of people said that he should have lost the title in 97, if not in 94, 94. But either which way, guys, 97, not the best version of Dory Nates at all. And of course, as we know, 2022, Big Rammy loses his Olympia title. So who is the worst loser, I guess, for the lack of a better term? We're not calling either one of these guys losers. I mean, the front double bicep pose, you can basically say Big Rammy is winning the matchup altogether. Don't even need to see the other shots. It is too much in the arm department for uh, Dorian Yates. And the more I look at this 1997 front double by of Dorian Yates, the worse it gets. And I mean, it's not like the rest of him is great. It's not like he has the best wheels in the world. Things of that nature. Here's a pan back shot, black and white. Uh, yeah, you can definitely see that Dorian, he may be the best of all time in terms of the calves, and that is something we didn't see from that first pitcher, guys. Look at that. And Big Rammy, very weak in that department. And you know what? Big Rammy, not the strongest in the arms either. But I mean, come on, come on. Look at Dorian's arm. Look at the elbow. Poor guy. Shouldn't even have been competing. Go through the shots here. And if there's any pose that Dory Nates would still look great in, it's this one. And of course, the back shots we haven't seen yet. Big Rammy's arm looks a little bit messed up. And it was, for sure. His tricep was gone, basically. A little bit there still, but... Eh, I like how they're both kicking their, uh, their leg up. Same type of ballet maneuver. <laughs> maneuver. I think Rammy might have better wheels. Of course, there's the hole in his quad. Many people will mention that. But, I mean, he has much bigger wheels than Dorian. Upper body, lats. Dorian's lats, I find that they are, oh, I don't know, Dorian-esque? Hmm? Anybody? Come on, come on. Funny for those of you who like uh, cheesy jokes. Turn to the side here. Just turn to the side. And you know what? Kind of undecided who I want to give this one to. Kind of undecided for sure. Does it matter that much in that front double for Dorian? He was surely winning in the front lat. Who's winning in the side chest? Big Remy, not the strongest pose for him. Dorian looks ripped. Peeled. I'll get you next time, Gadget. Next time. That's Dr. Claw. Uh, I don't know. Let's have a look at a hua pose. Ooh. Very exposing of Big Rammy's lack of tricep. Look at this, guys. Look at that. He has a better silhouette than Dorian. Dorian looks harder and greenier. Hard, greeny nature. <laughs> Dorian's calves actually look pretty good. Or uh, Big Rammy's calves actually look pretty good here in the side. Uh, Hoo-ha. Hoo-ha pose. And here is the tricep itself. Side tricep hit to spec. Normally, I would say, Dorian, he's cleaning house in this. But in 97, guys, you can't rely on his past performances. You know, 1993, pretty good. But here in 97, I am not impressed with this performance. Even the physique. And I apologize for that bad accent. But anyway, go to the back shots. And I'm sure this is going to be lights out for... Uh... For Dorian Yates, Dorian Yates usually so dominant in the back shots that it's not even funny. But I'm sure you're like me, slightly puzzled that Dorian Yates is not destroying Big Rammy in this shot. Big Rammy, clearly the more conditioned glutes, hamstrings, I would say. The overall conditioning's not this great 
you know, legendary striations and, you know, super conditioned athlete that you hear about Dory Nates. 97 kind of sucked. He looked like uh, Louis Marco said, a hot mess. Yeah. Big traps, though. Big traps. Rammy's not the best either, guys. So, I don't see anybody winning the rear lot. Go to the rear double. And Dorian Yates, he is faring much better in the rear double than he was in the rear lot. Because, I guess you could say, Big Rammy is not faring very well at all in this pose. Very exposing of the lack of lat insertions, which Dorian Yates has in spades. But, I mean, if you're a Dorianite, cover your ears, guys. Cover your ears. Dorian's lats are unsymmetrical. Quite unsymmetrical indeed. But, I mean, still defeating somebody with no lats at all. Here's a closer up shot. And if you were upset at my comment... Dorian Knights, take a look. I mean, do you see symmetrical lats here? I do not. I mean, both look pretty good individually. Look at the traps on Yates. But then again, look at the arms. Look at the arms on uh, Ramalama Ding Dong. More can do hey, I can see some Stroysians in the glutes now. Dorian Yates, maybe he just wasn't flexing them. But still, but still, guys. Come on, give me a break. Abs and thigh. Hmm, hmm. Now you go by that front double, there's no way. There's no way. Big Rammy, he wins, you know, rated at the first shot. Like I, like I said, rated at the shoot. But then a lot of the other poses, like this one here included, Dorian Yates is the clear winner. Abs, they're, I don't want to say messed up, but hey, what the heck. They're a little bit messed up there for Big Rammy. Ramalama Ding Dong, and obviously the quads, big hole in them. So does that match that bicep? I don't know, guys. That bicep was just a little tiny piece of meat hanging onto a bone. Go to the most muscular, even though it is not a mandatory shot for Yates. So if you do not want to count the uh, this pose in your final decision making, I guess that's fair. Dorian does seem to be in overall better condition. Thinner skin, things of that nature. Of course, the lighting was a whole lot better back then. His legs seem to be lacking the separation of his upper body, does uh, Yates. So maybe a lack of symmetry in condition. Whereas Big Rammy, his conditioning, conditioning rather is pretty even. He's a massive dude. He's a big dude. He's losing a lot of shots, though. I have to say, he was losing that abs and thigh. Maybe, uh, maybe the worst beating in all of the ma or all of the poses. Of course, that front double. You know what, guys? I think that front double did it for me. That should not be on display in bodybuilding, in particular, or particularly the uh, whatever word is proper. If for the Olympia champion, for a winner of the title. You know, that arm should not be displayed. And no, Rami was not the most aesthetically pleasing bodybuilder in the world. Hole in his quad, messed up midsection. But I think those things I can overlook. The bicep, tricep tear hanging off the bone. I just can't do it. Not gonna do it. Not at this time. So Rami, he's not losing, we'll say. I don't know want to call him a winner in this matchup. Neither guy's impressing me too much. But I'm a little bit more impressed with uh, Big Remy's performance than Dorian Yates. And he didn't even win the title. Hit thumbs up on the video, guys. That's your you pick uh, Friday. Fan requested Friday, not you pick. Wah, wah, wah. Get my day straight. Hit thumbs up, subscribe. Love you guys. Have a nice one.